can you talk a little bit on the design of tennis as a game and why you think it's such a beautiful and deep game? But the, de the design, the features of tennis, it's, uh, it has a long history. So there is a culture. It's universal. It's played everywhere. So that's, that's fantastic because you, uh, it, it's, it's well developed everywhere. But in itself, interestingly, I think it's the scoring system, which is amazing. The fact that it's a battle between two players, but without contact, something very special. Can and you talk about the scoring system? Oh, why, the why is it amazing? Why is it amazing? Because it's a strange <laughs> thing for people who don't play tennis. In fact, many beginning players want to forget about the, the scoring system completely. The, you know, why don't we just go one, two, three, four, five, six? You know, mm. there is uh, the, well, there is no use. At the end of the game, there will be a winner, there will be a, a loser. So that's that's important. Mm -hmm. You cannot play a bit soft uh, and arrange for uh, like a football match 2-2 uh, at the end of the match. No, there will not be 2-2. Two -two. have be, penalty serves. <laughs> you have to score another goal. Yeah. Um, so there is no use. Uh, there is no limit of time. So when you embark for a tennis match, you embark for a drama, a marathon. It's an adventure because of that. Mm. And the adventure lasts until one, one of the two collapses. Uh, so it's, it's an incredible story. To and replace, it's like Gladiator who goes until the, they are dead. Mm. The death, you know? Yeah, not many sports um, are like that, huh? Uh, without limit of time? Yeah, there's, there's not that. Not, yeah, there's only a few. Um, yeah. And why do you know why they score it like they do, like 15, 30, 40 deuce, and why it goes to six? I mean, these all seem very random from a beginner's yeah, standpoint. Yeah. Do you know the, the reason why they I know roughly, yeah. I know the history roughly, yes. But then, just I, I will, I, I can tell you that, but then just to finish about the feature, the features, it's uh, um. In tennis, you can have someone leading at the score during one hour. So during one hour, I'm leading at the score. I win the first set. I lead in the second set. So during one hour, I'm the leader of the race. Everything is fine. My opponent is far behind. And then in a few minutes, I have a little down. And of course, my opponent will have a up at, the, at that time. Or because just your opponent feels that it's the end for him. Like when you are reaching towards the end, your opponent will give you, you give his best because he's fighting mm. to survive. He's in the so corner. he can he can award you a few free points at the beginning where it's easy for you, but at the moment you're gonna die. There is a survival uh, uh, re resilience, and he's, he's 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 not going to give it to you. He's going to play his best mm. at the moment where you have to finish. It's difficult and and it's and you are getting more tired at that time also so it, gi it gives a lot of chance for the opponent to catch up all the time mm. and so you can lead for one hour and then you have five minutes or you are a little bit under the level of your uh, of your opponent and then you, you win the second set and then at the score it's one all <laughs> so it's one all but you have dominated so much and he didn't but it's one all Third set starts, you know, and um, so the the every game, every game the points the scoring systems are back at zero zero. There are so many times where you are back at zero zero, so you mm. always give a chance. Wow, that's, that's 